morning guys today we're going to be doing some shipped it's not the same intro like the past three videos we're actually doing something different so we're doing our first order at target it's only like 10 items and we're delivering to like some spa then we're going to be going back to a new heb location and we're going to be doing an order there basically our goal is to do seven orders without a promo today shop and deliver so if we do that we get a 55 dollars bonus it's going to be a lot of work to do especially for the amount of time that i have today we're going to be in a rush so that should be fun The blood creeping up from the heathens Got will, got fight, got pride, got reason If they wanna go eat, then you know I'm gonna feed them If you're coming for me, hope you're ready for it Alright, so the order went sorta of smooth Just one replacement on some like White Castle sliders Other than that, it was pretty good The problem is they weren't responding So I wasn't too sure what to do for the replacement So I just went with it because it's a business And it was like a lunch item So I was worried that if I didn't get it They wouldn't have lunch So I just, I did the best I could I'll see them in person and let them know I messed up and I forgot to search the address While I was in the store on their Wi-Fi. Luckily I sort of know where they're at So I'm just going to start driving until I get cell service So I'll probably see you guys at the next order Because I don't want to record their uh, business And put them on blast, you know Alright, so we're at the new HEB And we're going to go do this order It's only 19 items But I do not know the store well So I'm here really early for this order They said it was fine if I shop it early too So I'm going to go do this Try and like learn the store a bit more Holy crap the camera's shaking Anyways my last drop off was Kind of awkward like I didn't get any Delivery instructions apparently there's A back door that I could have delivered to But instead I was like walking through a crowd of Ladies getting their eyebrows done Looking at me like I was crazy To be in there but oh well it's definitely a, An interesting job I don't see any available orders right now And I have to do five more after this one that Doesn't sound bad you can do that Anyways, Q epic progress bar. Maybe if I get around to it. I can hear the demons call when they do what they do. And now I feel like taking off, find a place with the view. The pain is never gonna stop if it's controlling you. I know the time can heal it all. I just gotta get through. I just gotta get through. I wasn't able to get a response from the customer for like 15 minutes. And uh, they're probably just busy, but uh, they were responding the entire time until the very end when I needed to know if they wanted a replacement on this item. So I sat there for 15 minutes and called them and they wouldn't pick up. But sure enough, as soon as I called them, they didn't pick up. They did text me back. So sometimes that works if you guys are ever in a pinch like that. It can all be worth it, all the searching Pain is never really permanent, but damn it hurts, man I could feel all of the turbulence and it's concerning I've been searching for a purpose, I hope it's worth it This society is really trying me Ain't no hide and seek, I hide to be far from anxiety I need my space, I need my privacy, I need some signs, please Just dropped it off, I left them a little thank you note too so we'll see how that goes because I have no idea if they're even going to tip me or not. A lot of ship customers seem to just not, unfortunately. But yeah, I'm a little nervous because I don't have another order yet. So wish us luck. All right, so we just got another order. It's not the best. We're probably going to do a lot of driving for this, but we got to do it if we're going to hit that promo. All right, 10 minutes until we're at the store, then we'll shop it. And I'll see you then. So we just finished shopping our third order. We just got a bunch of orders. So I had to start dropping some because I just had too many for the same time slot. So I dropped two orders. Now we're in less of a pickle, but uh, we do have two more orders to do after this one that we already have selected. And then we'll be at five. So hopefully we're able to get to seven in a couple of hours. I got a 15 minute drive to the next drop off. Gotta get through this life is a nuisance, types nuisance. I try to be human, find a solution, my evolution A place like this, it didn't exist, you made it like this So you can go pick the bad or the good, got a glass halfway I know, it's easier to hide and just to lay low Not everyone in life has got a halo I'm standing in the red inside a payphone Just wanna break, no I'm not So like usual, we are in a time crunch We are almost halfway there though we're at the new HEB, which is a complete disaster, 
but we will take any order we can right now. Honestly, really stressing out about getting all these done in time and I just had some family stuff happen. I kind of just want to get today over with, but we still have to shop at least four more times, so we got to push through it. Just shop that order in like 10 minutes. We are running out in the parking lot trying to get this done as fast as possible. We should be good on delivering the next order on time as well. I know this order is going to be fine, but it's the next one that I'm worried about, and if we're late even by a minute, it doesn't count for the promo. So we're going to be really close on time again. And then we'll still have to do two more orders after the next one. This is just stressful. We're at HEB, let's go shop this. We got a, like a 10 minute delivery and we're gonna get there 10 minutes early. So we almost missed it, but we're good. That is a weight lifted off my shoulders. That was, that was very stressful. done now we just need two more orders I need to get these done pretty fast if I'm gonna get this uh, challenge done because I need to be heading out of here real soon there's a huge pothole right here I saw some truck drive through here at like 50 that dude's probably gonna need some new wheels but we're gonna head back to the HEB that we just shopped at we're gonna sit there for a bit and hope for a couple orders because that's also really close to the Target that I like to shop at. All right, so on my way to that HEB, I got a Target order and it was really stressful because I clicked accept and it wasn't going through because I was in an area with no cell service, so it was just loading. So I drove over here to a place we won't name, but uh, they have some guest Wi-Fi that I got on and it said that I did get the order. So I don't have to deliver that one to like six or seven. So I'm gonna sit here for a minute and see if we could get another Target store order so we can do two at once. All we need is two more orders, guys. Two more. Hopefully my camera's still working. I just dropped it so hard. Anyways, we just got our last order. I've been sitting here for like 45 minutes. I was like, man, this is a little too convenient for shipped. I was seeing orders in every other county like near me, just not the one that I'm shopping in. And it's also like the busiest hour on the busiest day. A little sus shipped, not gonna lie. Anyways, we got our last shipped order. It's only six items. We're dropping off close to our house. Very happy to call today. We're uh, probably gonna be close to 200, but I'll record the last bit of this video probably tomorrow just because I'm not gonna get half the tips in. So far we've had a few very generous tippers though, so we're gonna be paid pretty well today. I wouldn't be surprised if we get close to 200 for about seven hours of work. Last order, right there, that'll get us to seven. In seven hours, it's about an order every hour, mostly just because we had to wait around a lot. Otherwise, we could have done a lot more. There just weren't enough orders for us to take. Pretty easy to do like two shipped orders at once. So that's the only reason I say that. So I'll probably see you guys in a minute whenever I'm done dropping this off. And uh, for me, it'll probably be like a day or two before I come back and tell you how much I made just because it takes a while for tips to come in on this app. How's it going guys? So it has been a full day since we did the shipped challenge and it was all right. We still are missing four tips and they may just not tip at all. It's like actually over half of my customers that day have not tipped me. This is like the main reason why I'm not a huge fan of shipped, but lately Instacart has been slacking so it's the best we got. Anyways, in total, without the promo, we made $113, which equates to about 14 an hour, but thankfully they had that $55 bonus. So we made a total of $169 and we may get some more tips in the future. There's like no time restraint on how late they tip me. It's possible we may have made more. So if you include the bonus, let's see how much we made per hour. And we worked about eight hours, by the way. 
So with the bonus, we were closer to 21 an hour, which saves the hourly rate and actually makes it pretty nice. If my tips change at all, I will go in the comment section down below and update you guys. But that's basically it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys slap that like button and I'll see you guys on the next video.